Hey guys, Stock Miner here. Uh, just bringing you back for a little bit of update. This uh, recording is kind of awkward for me because I'm trying to make sure I don't accidentally turn it off. And I am expecting a uh, tweet from the ever so humble pig, Mr. Picklesworth, uh, starting a stream, which probably will start after I'm, I'm done recording here, but I never know. Um, anyway, I'm down here in my mine, and I was taking out some iron, and I found this cave system. got a brand new spawner. Uh, I am anxious to get into this. I got a couple of horse armors and a couple of name tags out of this one. And uh, just under a stack of iron and a couple of other goodies. Not much else in this little cave here, but I do want to light it up. work on that farm, so I am going to convert that into yet another farm, with uh, so many players on the server, it's nice to have more than one option, oops, now I'm getting lost in my own tunnels here, uh, but before we do that, <coughs> I just want to show my server mates where it's at, oh, I'm going to be... so it's not far from any of the other spawners that I found. Um, run down here. I did block this off just in case I missed some lighting. I do tend to over torch, but I do occasionally miss a spot. The other zombie spawner is right there. So it's uh, just a little bit over there. Might have to check the uh, distances between the two, but I'm pretty sure they're too far apart for a dual spawner farm. One of the um, what I want to do right now is open to here. Ash needed a name tag. Um, I'm going to take these horse armors. To the nether because there's a couple pit ponies without them. Trying to see if there's anything else I need here. Working on a uh, nice bow. These are all combinations of drops that we got from the new Skelly Farm. I do need to seriously rework this base. Still haven't finished the slime farm. This one for I took the gunpowder out of here earlier. That was a 9 PD. We found my ender chest. Um, I haven't even checked my cactus farm in a while. Here, I haven't mentioned the area for to do much. I did make a mistake. I was make, doing a bunch of uh, Another warp blocks and stuff like that. And I forgot to replant before I made all my blocks. And I was literally down to one warp. <laughs> so I am slowly recovering from that mistake. Okay. I started working down here. Which just about everything I've, I've been planning, I've been running into some mistake that's caused it to quit or make me change my plans. Um, so I got I got two rooms here. So I got to do the ceiling in there. These rooms are actually uh, spawn proof because they're half blocks. The light is just for effect. I want to work on a better ceiling, but I'm not sure how to do it. So I'm not done. I 
have for my server mates. If anybody wants these pieces of armor, I know Nathan Paul said he was returning to the server soon. I know he loves uh, using mob drop only. And we are fully repaired mob drop armor because it's mob drop. Kicking, there's only two there. <sighs> that is kind of frustrating having not just Minecraft ops, cop center disorder, but actually obsessive compulsive disorder. Um, controlling it can be really hard because I really want to turn back and fix that, but I, for the sake of video, I'm mean, resisting it. Morning, cool. um, <laughs> it's low age. Somebody get blown up outside? I don't know. There you go, Ash. Yeah, it's getting sundown. Hop uh, in. I love the views from this house. <laughs> Uh, showing my nephew, uh, Legion Warlord, came over the other day, and I was showing him this, and I was, uh, Gummy Gamer hadn't been on in a while, and she popped in, and I was showing her too. I think this would be really fun. Uh, on our season two, we had what we called a Gummy Launcher, <coughs> and it was a Slime Block Player Launcher up high in the tree, the original tree, and uh, we'd, shoot, we'd shoot ourselves off and I think that'd be kind of kind of fun in a tower like that. That looks, oh, I think that's a mine. I got, I got about to build a couple of gummy launchers for the server, I just haven't got around to it. 
Intersections. This was an intersection, and this is my. I guess you call it a ghetto uh, skull farm. Nothing fancy like a Zumaloid would build, but. So there's that. Kind of want to expand it here, and I don't like regular skeletons, they get me in trouble. Because they shoot pigmen. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to expand it. There's like five intersections like right near each other. And they lead to the rest of <laughs> the fortress. Which is inconvenient for anybody trying to get to the blaze farms. <clears throat> well, potential blaze farms. So I don't think anybody started building those yet. I haven't figured out where to put it yet. I tweeted a uh, picture the other day of... This. I'm still working on this, guys. Uh, I'm sorry, it does go down and you can use all the tunnels and just... They're awkward. Skeleton farm. I use the bone blocks like uh, bricks on some of the uh, fancy. are fully sorted, automatically sorted. This is the actual above sea level engines. <coughs> so here's where the potential brewing station is. There's, uh, there's water bottles in here for now. Okay, so this one pulls out the bones. This one pulls out the arrows. And this <laughs> is not supposed to work like that. Um, <clears throat> this one actually will pull out the armor and bows. I think I gotta turn this. This is just a temporary whole chest that does not uh, bones, arrows, or 
unstackable that's supposed to land over here, but I think I gotta turn that. Um, so, yeah, and then I'll, have, I'll eventually get this so you can access it from the other side. So I should probably do that now before anybody jams up the system. Got my axe on me? Yes, I do. And that's just the torch tower that activates the. Uh, Oh, hey, I got it. The elevator for um, the storage chest. Yeah, I think that will work. Let's uh, get those items back in there. And, uh, yep, it works. All right, so there's that part. Eyes are showing me that there's not enough light, but I'm, I know there is. So I think I went over that with a fine piece of film. I gotta find a home for the ender chest. So now it's kind of nice to have the ender chest there. You crack it over here. Look at some other birds in the sand. Most of them get around in the bones for bone blocks. Take a little bit of time for the uh, skeletons to go all the way up to the water level, basically. That one died and shot it out. <coughs> for my server mates, the, uh, the items go from here into a dropper, shoot into a water stream, go right under here. So, guys, so don't get it. This liner breaks. And then it goes into the sorting so far. Instead of using you know, a dozen hoppers or so, I just use a water stream. These are all, uh, all one part. Skeleton farm. A little bit of uh, recess light in this right The only place that they can is if there wasn't enough light, they don't have these books. with something a little bit prettier than stone. The original idea I had here was to have multiple tiers with like glass around it just to make it into a, a room. <coughs> but there's not much <coughs> you can actually get in here. 
So what I did is I asked Ash for some help. for Ash of what I was thinking, just get some blocks here since I didn't bring any with me. Uh, I need the four sat the four. Southeast, west, maybe have uh, your little terrarium that you built on uh, what was it, season three or four. So you got, you know, when you come up the stairs, you got like a little garden scene, and then you come up and another little garden scene. I'm not sure how you get them all in here so they don't cause problems with each other but that's kind of the idea that I had those little terrarium kind of things look really nice uh, like I had said on, on Twitter you know because like, we we're debating if we want full size trees in here or, uh, where are you I want your pearl where are you Or uh, <coughs> if we just want like little little farms, which now that I think about this might be a good place to put another work farm, but <laughs> that's still still debatable. Looks like Ash took her bed out of here, and it's nighttime, and I don't feel like riding on him because I suck. I mean, <laughs> well, I do. Not very good at coming back. for quartz at the moment.